We're here at the Total stand and joining me now is Jean-Luc Guizot. He is the president for Total UAE. Jean-Luc, thanks so much for joining us and I know you've had a busy time here. Um, tell us a little bit about Total's involvement here and I know, you know, even from the, the very top you've had representation here. Good morning and yes indeed, the uh, chairman and CEO of Total, Christophe de Margerie, has participated to the uh, executive panel of, uh, at the opening day of, uh, of the ADPEC leading uh, in that way the uh, participation of Total uh, to the ADPEC of, the, of this year. The ADPEC is, uh, is uh, one of the uh, uh, highest and most uh, important uh, conferences for Total and uh, this year there will be more than uh, 30 uh, presentations uh, given by Total experts and uh, Total managers. And this is wonderful to have so many people involved in this. We were looking at the rundown for the technical sessions for all of that. And again, as you say, their expertise coming from Total, very important. What are you hearing from the people who are coming to the stand? I mean, I, I bet they're looking for your experts to, to share best practice and tell them what's going on. Yes, in fact, the spirit of Total participating in the ADPEC uh, is to contribute to the exchange of information uh, across the, uh, the players in the industry, specifically here in the Middle East. I have to... Uh, I have to say that the, uh, this event uh, has been a great success and uh, we need to congratulate uh, uh, Ali Al Jarwan, who is uh, the CEO of ADMA, who has put uh, an excellent conference and an excellent exhibition with the help of the SPE and of the industry, uh, obviously. And uh, our visitors on our stand, yes, they are, they are keen to learn about uh, the uh, advanced technologies that uh, Total has developed and can be uh, uh, and that can be applied in the, in the region, as well as uh, they were curious to see um, other features of our, of our stand, uh, some of our education initiative, for instance, like uh, the Total ABK Academy initiative. Now, one of the things, yes, we were at the stand earlier, and you had a lot of young Emirati visitors too, which I know you're very proud of, and, um, but they were very active dealing with your people. Tell us a little bit about that project. Well, these young uh, UAE nationals that we can see on our stand, they are the living proof of uh, the success of that uh, Total EBK Academy initiative. In a nutshell, it is uh, an initiative which uh, trains young UAE nationals to become uh, field operators offshore and uh, they then uh, uh, take positions uh, in the industry, not only in Total EBK, uh, that was the beginning of our initiative, we, we needed some operators offshore, but also for other offshore uh, companies like uh, Bunduk, like uh, Adma Opco, who joined the program. This program is, um, is managed by Total, but it is fully supported by ADNOC and our partner, VEDC, uh, Vocational Education uh, Department. Well, wonderful, and long may that continue. I'm sure everybody finding that very valuable. Now, of course, um, Total has been in the region for many, many years. Um, how are things here? You're busy, you're doing lots of business. Tell, tell us what you can. How are things going? Well, as you know, Total was born in the Middle East. So the Middle East is, uh, is uh, a core region for Total. In, in, in fact, in all the segments of the, indus of the industry, we've been present uh, on the upstream, obviously, but also on the petrochemicals. Uh, we're present on the, on the uh, marketing and specifically here in, uh, in Abu Dhabi we are uh, quite active on, on most of our joint ventures with the ADNOC group of companies uh, such as ADCO, such as ADMA, you know that there are many projects to uh, increase the production from both, uh, from both companies. We're also quite active with uh, our partner Mubadala with the Dolphin project, which uh, supplies gas from Qatar to uh, the uh, Emirates and to Oman, as well as uh, through uh, Masdar uh, on the renewable uh, development uh, with the Masdar project, the Shams project, uh, uh, which is a solar plant which will be uh, uh, put into uh, I would say production at the early of 2013. Well, super. So you're busy keeping the total stamp and the name alive here in the UAE. Thank you so much, Jean-Luc Guizot. Thank you. Thank you, Edna.